breaking news. Welcome to today's headlines. Mazi Unamdekano's release will be negotiated. Mazi Unamdekano release will be negotiated, says Governor Soludo. To my dear listeners, from wherever you're listening from, please stay tuned as I read to this news. Governor Chukuma Soludo of Anambra State says agitation for release of the leader of the indigenous people of Biafra, Hypop, Mazi Unante Kanos will be negotiated and approached with diplomacy. Governor Soludo who stated this during the town hall meeting he had with the market leaders and leaders of different transport unions in Hauka noted that violence would not resolve the problem. Governor Soludo maintained he endorsed the recent statement made on March 7, 2022 by the Joint Body of Southeast Council of Traditional Rulers and Bishops Archbishops on Peace and Conflict Resolution, requesting for a tripartite discussion between them, the Presidency and Southeast Governors to deal with the conflict in the Southeast, especially in relation to Unamdekanu, the indigenous people of Biafra, Hypop, and the Eastern Security Network, ESN. The governor, however, called on the Hebrew brothers with arms to lay down their arms as his administration does not encourage shedding of blood of any sort. Maintaining that Anambra has all it takes to be great, Governor Sulodo noted that everyone is important to the development of Anambra state. Helia the IPOB warned Charles Ludo against going after its members. IPOB warned Soludo not to succumb to advice of arresting, imprisoning, and killing its members in the state. Emmanuel Powerful, spokesman of the separatist group, warned that such a step would mark the beginning of Soludo's failure as a governor. Powerful also cautioned the new governor against repeating the same mistake his predecessor Willie Obiano made while in power. He, however, assured Soludo of IPOBs of cooperation and support. The group was reacting to Soludo's recent comment that he was willing to work with the group to tackle insecurity in the state. According to Powerful, a number of state governor Professor Charles C. Soludo, in order to succeed, must not take seriously those or anyone, whether part of his government or not, that will advise him to arrest, imprison, and kill a poor family. I pop family members in a number of states because if he listens to those criminal political halot, that will be the beginning of his failure as a governor. We therefore advise Saludo to remain focused on his vision and mission and shun distractions and bad advice from evil politicians. He should not repeat the mistakes of his predecessor, Willie Obiano, who allowed himself to be used by Fulani people to persecute our people. They killed our people at Unkbo in 2016, during our annual remembrance of our fallen heroes, 
and earrings who paid the ultimate price for our freedom between 1967 and 1970, yet the governor never asked questions. Hype Up is a peaceful movement, working hard to restore Biafra's independence. We will never give up on our agitation until we are given a date for referendum to decide our fate as a people. We are ready to work with anyone in government who works for the interest and liberty of our people. Professor Charles Soludo is a seasoned technocrat and an accomplished ego we should use his wealth of knowledge to develop our land. We are willing to support him as long as he will not turn to be a willing instrument in the hands of our oppressors to persecute our people, especially be Afro legitators who wish him sources in office. Governor Chukuma Suludu of Anambra State says agitation of release of the leader of the indigenous people of Biafra hyper. Mazi Unam the canoes will be negotiated and approached with diplomacy. Governor Suludu, who started this during the town hall meeting, he had with the market leaders and leaders of different transport unions in Hoka noted that violence would not resolve the problem. Governor Soludo maintained he endorsed the recent statement made on March 7, 2022 by the Joint Body of Southeast Council of traditional rulers and bishops, hajj bishops on peace and conflict resolution requesting for a tripartite discussion between them, the presidency and southeast governors to deal with the conflict in the southeast, especially in relation to Unam de Kanu, the indigenous people of Biafra Lipob and Eastern Security Network, ESN. To my dear listeners, now we've come to the end of our today's news. Please do drop by here the comment section and let us know what your view is all about. Thank you for listening.